Hey y'all, what up, what up, what up, what's goody? I just thought, why not do a really quick um, video? I was going through 2019 videos, old videos, three years ago videos. And I saw Lenise had this video I wanted to react to really quickly. So let me get my banner out. Mm. Le uh, Jasmine went live after I went live, right? Talking shit about Olivia. Then she went and hid her shit all scared and shit. I saw some of it, but it was kind of boring. So I was like, nah, it ain't nothing really good to watch anyway. So, but she's talking smack though. All right. This one's called, this was before she left to Texas, before she left Texas. Lanise TV has this. I did not birth my children so another bitch could mother them. If you want kids, ugly hoe, you need hold to have your own Hold on, hold on, hold on, And I said, I didn't birth, I didn't, let me just tell you something. I did not birth my children so another bitch could mother them. If you want kids, ugly hoe, you need to have your own babies, okay? You already got my husband. You can have him. You fought. You fought hard and long for him. You even waited, bitch. You waited. Okay, you were like one of them dumb bitches that have the men to get locked up. You know what? No, you're worse than that, hoe. Because <laughs> this nigga came to Florida, married my fucking ass, okay? And there you are just waiting, just waiting until they have another argument so he'll come running back to your lonely, desperate ass. Okay, you won. So fuck. But I'm gonna get my fucking respect. I'm gonna get my respect. Period. Yeah. I thought you were another pen. I'm not even gonna answer that. That's exactly. That's exactly why he didn't come in. <laughs> she just took out the trash. Like, oh yeah, she made, and all she did was take out my trash. Thank you, bitch. The fuck? What kind of desperate ass hoe is that? And he's telling you, oh, he regrets marrying me. He regrets it so much. Did he look like he would regret it shit on that beach, bitch? He was crying and everything, hoe. Oh, yeah, he regretted it. Bitch, please. No, no. He didn't regret a motherfucking thing. I just didn't trust him no more, and I... I did what I did. But you know what? That's neither here nor there. The point is... The point is... Mm. Is he cannot... He cannot take a dose of his own medicine. He wants to fuck you over, but the moment you fuck him over, oh, he can't take it. He can't take it. Nigga, fuck you. You get what you get, nigga. You just want a bitch that's not going to take your shit. I never took your shit. I allowed it. But you ain't new. Fuck, you needed an easy, weak-ass bitch like this bitch. Weak-ass hoe. Weak-ass bitch. <laughs> oh, I know, baby. I know, Kimmy. You right. No court will give him the kids with that picture. Wait till y'all see. No, I'm going to put the video on here. I'm going to give that to my lawyer. He got me fucked up. Honestly, truly. This was... Stop being up. petty and move on. Block her. Stop being petty. This was before she lost custody, obviously, because this was three years ago. And this is when she was living in Texas and was with Brandon, I believe, right? Can move on. Block that person. Fuck it, I'll block her. Block. Goodbye. <laughs> Who's in my chat? What are these bitches in my chat? Why are bitches in my chat but don't come in my face, though? Don't be in my chat and you don't show up in my face, ho. That's on period. Yeah, the picture's on Instagram. Mm -hmm. Of him drinking and driving. My babies. My three babies. Yes. Mm -hmm. And that's why the CPS worker was called. That's why there's a case. And that's why he's not able to drive my kids. Okay? Because he's so carelessly. He don't give a fuck. He don't care. But he wants to come over here. Like, I don't understand. If you don't want me, you don't want me. But why all the aggression? Why all the rudeness? Why all the name calling? Put he called me a bitch. He's a nerd. He said, yeah, bitch. I said, bitch. He said, yeah, bitch. You are a bitch. I said, oh, my God. This nigga really just called me a bitch. And he said he really want to punch me in the fucking face. You want to punch me in the fucking face, Gerard? Well, why didn't you? Bitch ass nigga. Is it the same reason you didn't do shit when Brand was in your face? Bitch ass nigga. What? 
but I'm I'm so Girl, bad. Like, get a cup. I just don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand. You're so happy. You found the one. Like you're so like the way you describe this new relationship you're in, it's like you're on cloud nine. So I'm just like putting myself in your position. If I was in such a good relationship, usually it makes you feel good about everything else. So why are you why are you so much aggression towards me? I don't understand. What did I do? I told your bitch what you did. You came over here in December and fucked me. But that was after you told Brandon. You told Brandon first. So I was supposed to just be like, okay, okay. There's no problem. Like, oh, okay, Gerard, you're just gonna get away with that one again? No, fuck you. I told your bitch, yes, honey. He ate my ass. He ate my pussy. He fucked me twice. Um, Ew, I guess. you're okay with that. God. You're okay with having my leftovers. You're okay. <laughs> it's okay. He's like, oh, that was so long ago. Okay, well, that's a long time. That's cool. I think you've been with her for a couple months, though, haven't you? Andrew Webb is in the chat. Thank you, Carol, for the super chat, babe. What's going on? Andrew, I think I only know you by your nickname. What is his nickname? Because Andrew Webb is not ringing a bell. I'm just sick of it, you guys. I'm so sick of it. He has so much aggression. He's so rude. After everything I've done, what, baby? I have a candy, but I was actually, I put my, I put my, I put my, I put my candy in, in my bag. I don't know where your candy is, baby. Are you not with Brandon? No. No. Um, more for sex fun? You guys want some soup? More for sex soup? No? What do you guys want to eat? I want ravioli. I don't know if I have raviolis, baby. I'll check, though. So, I have, um, my candy, like, Brandon got, Brandon got, Brandon got you candy? Yeah. I don't know where it is, baby. There's no candy on the counter. I don't know how long ago that was. I don't know. I don't know. I don't see a candy, son. I don't see no candy. I'm sorry. You probably ate it earlier. Uh-uh. There was some more candy in there. Somebody sent me another super chat. Who would do with that? Okay, I'm going to make you guys something. So everybody, scat, or I'm going to make you clean the living room. You either go back in there and play the game, or you're going to help me clean. What do you want to do? I'm going to make you something right now, okay? Okay, baby, I'm going to make it right now. Give me a second. Remember, I told you I just wanted to clean up the dishes. You can have them. I don't care. Take them. Don't smell them on the floor. Don't get them in the carpet. You understand me? Okay. Okay. Uh, what, baby? You want for that still? No, no. Go ahead. His position. And it's her talking like that while the kids are listening to her. They're listening to everything, y'all. If I was in his position, honestly, truly, like, if I really found the greatest person in the world and I was so happy... And, like, my ex, which is him, my kid's father, still wanted to be with me. Or, no, let me just reverse it and act like I'm the man. Because I feel like men have a little bit more responsibility. Like, especially if they don't have the kids and the mom has the kids. Like, I feel like if I was him in his situation and my baby mama, wife, whatever the fuck. No, wife, because that's what it is. Wanted to be with me or whatever the fuck the case may be. If I didn't want to be with her and I was so happy in my relationship, I would at least be like... I don't know. I would just handle things differently. The way he's handling this situation is so disgusting. Like, I don't understand. I just don't get it. I could be a funny ass bitch. I'm not. I'm motherfucking Olivia, bitch. Okay? I'm gonna run my mouth, especially to a nigga like you. Oh, nigga, fuck you. I'm not even gonna respect you anymore. I'm not gonna respect you. I'm sure y'all sitting there watching this. <laughs> She's talking like, baby, you can use this against her in court, baby. You can use this against her in court. Okay? No, you can't. Try it if you want to. Try it. <laughs> yeah, that's another thing. I said, you're he, he has a nerve to come up here and show some bullshit. I guess y'all be sending him messages on, on Instagram. I looked at his messages and I was like, that, that shit ain't got nothing to do with me. Why are you showing me that shit? That a troll sent you a message about me? I don't give a fuck. People send me messages about you all the fucking time. You think I give a fuck? <laughs> Why are you on there talking shit? Uh, uh, telling lies. I said, what is the lie that I have told? What lie have I told? I'm still trying, I'm still confused. He still hasn't told me nothing. Oh, wait, no, he did. He said that he doesn't help me. I haven't received a dime from you. A dime from you in months. Months. <laughs> because he doesn't have to pay for my life. That's what he says. You don't have to pay for my life. <laughs> Isn't that one of the reasons you broke up? Because you could never afford my life, you stupid ass. You could never. You could never. You could never. It's not about me. It's about the babies. The babies are expensive. You know this. You don't do shit. But you can't pay for my life? Ew, is that some other shit that this ugly bitch is telling you? And 
and then you're taking advice from a bitch that doesn't have kids. She has no idea of this situation, and you're taking advice from her. You're so stupid. You're so dumb. You're so stupid. All she's gonna get to, because I would, look it, I'm not the one, you guys. I'm not the one. I wouldn't even, even though I have that proof of him drinking and driving, I haven't showed the CPS worker. I was supposed to send her that stuff. I haven't even showed her. That's the type of bitch I am. That's how, the type of down ass bitch that I am. I haven't even showed her that information. And if he wasn't acting like this, I wouldn't even take this shit to court. But every single time I see him, oh, you gonna get some papers from my lawyer. My, my paper, the papers from the lawyer are coming. Like, okay, why are you trying to write down on me with some papers? I'm not gonna do shit to you. I'm here taking care of your kids, waiting for you to wake the fuck up and be like, hey, maybe I should spend some time with my kids. Maybe I should, oh my God. Oh, I just feel like I'm going crazy. <laughs> I feel like I'm losing my mind, bro. And I just have nothing but fucking people trying to fight with me and shit. And he is just so horrible of a person. I can't believe he turned out like this. Like, we done some fucked up shit to each other, but this right here, woo, this takes the cake. This really does. This really takes the cake. And he wants to, like, really, I'm, like, when he tells me certain things, like, I'm like, who are you trying to convince? Are you trying to convince yourself that you don't want me? Who are you trying to convince? Where is the microphone? Like, I don't understand. Like, okay, you don't want me. Okay, all right. Since I don't want to be with you, I can't be in my kid's life. When did I say that? The fuck? I never said that shit. The fuck? It's so crazy, man. Just because I don't want them around that fucking homewrecker ass, nasty ass whore, that means that, what? It's either me or her? No, it's you and your kids, you dumbass. Fucking weak ass. Weak ass, little bitch. Weak ass. <laughs> no, I kind of feel like even when we talk, I can't get a word in. Like I can't say anything because he's just nothing but blaming, blaming, shitting on me, shitting on me. I can't even get a word in. And the way he treats me is a whole nother thing. He treats me like like he's talking to a piece of shit. Like that's how he talks to me. So this right here. Because best believe, he watches all of my shits, okay? He's that bitch, okay? I know he's going to watch this, he's going to see this. So this is my way of telling him what I need to tell him. And also, I'm venting and I'm getting this off my fucking... I need to get this out of my head, okay? And I really do believe that someday I will be in a way better place. And I can look back on this and I can be like, oh my fucking god. Like, bitch, I was going through it. I'm just, I'm just sick of it. Don't talk to him anymore, get a lawyer. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm going to. Trust me, I'm going to. I'm definitely going to. Because it's just, just like, damn, man. How much betrayal can one person take? How much betrayal can one person take? I don't understand. Like, what does he want me to do? He wants me to kill myself or something? Like, I don't understand what he's trying to make me do. I don't even understand how you can be so mean. Get it, baby? If you see it, get it. But I'll not fall down. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. I don't even understand how you can be so mean to a person. After all of this, I'm still not even mean. <laughs> but this, this is mean. This is what he calls mean. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Ugh. Okay. Let me see. Okay, here. Go sit down. Nah, nah. You want oranges, Robin? Ryan? Hmm? Or you want peaches? I guess we don't have oranges anymore. Or you want a go Can you go get it? Go get it. My mom just didn't raise me like that. She raised me better than that. Hey, Bubba Bee. It's bad. Go sit at the table and don't spill it, Ryan. And it's exactly the way that I will be teaching my kids. You know what I mean? So, you're welcome, baby. So we can talk crap. I really, honestly, am a firm believer in God knows who I am. God knows who I am. He knows who I am. So, I already know, just from looking at him and hearing what's coming out of his mouth, he's so easily influenced. And that's another reason why I didn't I didn't like to be with him because you're a grown man. You should think for yourself. You should make your, you should form your own opinions. But what he's done ever since I've known him, which is eight, um, what, nine years, whatever, he's always been so easily influenced by other people. And that's a turn off. Don't do that. Stop. Okay, go in the room. It's Jay. I'm out. He's easily influenced. So, like, the stuff that he was saying, even right now, like, ew, who said that? I'm not on. That's what you get. But no, no. I guess yeah. The bitch is always overhearing everybody's conversations. She makes everybody very uncomfortable. Just letting you know, bitch. Okay, not just me. Okay, other people say it too, bitch. 
Fucking controlling ass insecure hell. Mm. And you right, I feel so bad for you. I feel so bad for you, bro. Because you don't even know what you're doing to yourself. But you'll, you'll keep living in this make-believe world where I am, I'm the bad person, of course. And I, I'm always wrong. He's never wrong, I'm always wrong. And you know, he wonders why we still argue, why we still fight, because he's still on the same bullshit. I took my kids to this party this weekend. I went out of my way. You know, because he can't come here. Can't come here. I even, I was at the park one day, he called me, asking me, oh, can I get my kids? No. Did you call CPS? Did you feel that situation? Can we talk like grown adults? Can we figure this shit out? You can meet me at the park. No, I can't meet you at the park. Okay. So I go out of my way, which I had no problem. I wanted to see his family, me and his sisters. We had such a good time. It was a great time. Like we had a really, really great time this weekend. Mm -hmm. um, he wasn't even there. I was there for like an hour and a half. He wasn't even there. You know, and it's cool, because like I said, I had a great time hanging out with his family. But the whole point, he called me earlier that morning, Saturday morning, to ask me, are you going to the party tonight? I said, yes. Are you going to the party tonight? He said, yes. Okay, click. I thought it was an understanding that I'm going to be there so you can see your kids, so you can hang out with them. I mean, hello. He wasn't there. So he shows up. He shows up. He walks in. I'm drunk, okay? At this point, y'all... I'm drunk, okay? Drunk. <laughs> oh, Lord. Girl. I feel so stupid. But anyway, he comes in. He holds the baby. Robin and Christian are asking me, why didn't, why didn't Daddy hug and kiss us? I don't know if he did. I didn't see, I didn't see him hug or kiss anybody because I was in the kitchen. I didn't want to see him. I didn't want to see him. <sighs> but, you know. He came into the house. Uh, he went to change the baby's diaper. I went in the room and I started talking to him. And I was I was so drunk, you guys. I was so drunk at this point. I don't even know what the fuck I was saying. I just know that I started crying. Okay, a bitch was crying. He had to go. His bitch was outside. Like, <laughs> and he left. He left. He was only there for 10 minutes and he fucking left. <laughs> I was like, oh, that's nice. That's nice. So... Of course, there's my kids. Why did daddy leave? Where's daddy? Where's daddy? Where's daddy? Where's daddy? Where's daddy? I don't know. He had to go. He had to go because his girlfriend told him to go, I guess. He had to go. And I guess he came back, but he didn't want to come. He, he had the nerve to come back with his bitch. Look it. I could have been a whole bitch, and I could have brought Brandon. I could have brought whoever the fuck I wanted to bring over there, but I already know. It's not about our relationship, but I'm just saying, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't bring another man around him just because I already know he's not going to like that. He can say what he wants to say. You bitches can believe what the fuck you want to believe, but he's not going to like sitting there with me and another dude right there in the mix. Just like I don't want to see that bitch. I don't want to see her. It's about his kids. It's about him spending time with his kids. And that's all it's about. That's it. That's it. And of course, yes, can we have a conversation at some point of the next? Can we have a conversation? Maybe it wasn't the best thing that I was drunk like that, you know, but I was so... Oh, I think I know what I was you're so talking drunk. about. But I wasn't, like, problematic drunk. Like, I was trying to fight him or trying to start drama. No, I was just trying to have a conversation, and I think I was crying because he was trying to leave. And I was like, why are you leaving? All of it just didn't make any sense. It didn't make any sense. But all I wanted him to do was spend time with his, with his kids. And he left because of that bitch. So, okay. Once again, I feel like it's another point. Another point taken. Because I keep trying. Oh, fuck. What time is it? Is it, you guys? I don't even know what time it is. I'm so lost. He owes yeah. me shit. Yeah, you would think so. You would fucking think so. Because of all the games he's played, all the bullshit he's done, like... Even before, like when he was coming around me, it was never about let's get on a good page. Um, oh, it's two o'clock. Let's find another one. On a good page for the kids. No, it was always him trying to fuck, trying to be all up on me, trying to worry. And I'm not even. Say Let me see. Oh, look at this one. <laughs> Let me see. 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 Let me see.
Livy Pool, remember this? You're reminiscing. Happy Friday. Oh, Shay, what's up, baby? Oh, she doesn't have the video. She's talking about it. But shout out to Shay. I love Shay. I love Shay. I thought it was a video. <laughs> Let's see. This is Mist and Cakes. 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 Who she's with. I don't care about the car he drives. I don't care about the job he has. I don't care about none of it. They can go to fucking Paris tomorrow and get married and post right. it all over the internet. Bitch, I'm not going to flinch. I don't care. Yeah, right. I, don't I only care. care about my kids. My three babies. That's it. He recently went to Vegas. Do you guys understand how many bitches posted that shit and they tagged me in it? <laughs> Trying to upset me, okay? Bitch, I didn't give a fuck. That ain't no fucking flex. And even if it was a flex, and it's a flex to him, cool, cool, awesome, buddy. You went to Vegas. Been there a hundred times. I'm from LA, you feel me? And But that's awesome. Yes. It's not about that. But the thing that I cared about when I saw that he was out of town, <laughs> where are my kids? Who are my kids with? Who are my kids with? Where are my kids? That's all I give a fuck about. People on the, on this internet still trying to make this shit about him and I. This shit has not been about him and I for the longest time. Like, bro, I don't give a like, fuck. Yeah. Oh my God, I don't care. Go to Paris, fucking Africa, Amsterdam, travel the world. Where are my kids, bro? That's it, bro. Honey, that's it and that's all. Jeez Louise. That's it and that's all. Anyway. What time is it? It's 12.53. My baby is doing great. Thank you for asking. Mm -hmm. Nope. What's this one? What are you trying to tell you? Okay, all right. Lord, y'all hear this? Kids. Hey! Kaylin and Amaya. Chill. <laughs> Keep your hands to yourself. I didn't even touch her. All I did was this. Keep your hands to yourself. And I'm lying. I don't care. I'll put. Don't swing at nobody. I guess y'all ready to go to bed. Yeah, I can up. She's just acting up, y'all. Like, if they do this whenever I get on live, it's like they know. They're like, no, I'm not live. Oh, I took some onions into it. I had some too. Darn it. Let's see. Ugh. Everybody just eat a taco. I'm about to see the twins eat a taco. They do not ever eat tacos, y'all. Which drives me crazy here. I just be out here so I can see y'all. Don't mind all this, okay? It's Halloween. It's trick or treat candy. Yeah, her ear's fine. I, yeah, I've been, I've been shopped. I shopped at Costco's like one time. Oh, shit. This is boring. Let's go back. Hey, y'all. How y'all doing? Sorry if it's a little boring. I'm just reminiscing going back.
What is this right now? Oh, TMR's life. All right, I'm going to go check out TMR's life. Love y'all. Peace.